interviewing my grandparents, Gumpy and Nana, on the topic of lockdown. What is your opinion of lockdown? It's not really so bad, uh, not for us anyway. Um, it hasn't affected our lives too much, except we can't see our grandchildren, we can't walk on the beach, and we can't go to church. What are you doing during lockdown? Oh, we've done lots of things. We're painting some projects, we're painting gates. Uh, I made a big, really crazy puzzle that's actually called a wasgish, not a jigsaw, but it's a really crazy one. We are, uh, Gumpy's learning to cook. Tell them what you learn to cook, Gums. I've been cooking some delicious meals. I made a few lunches. Um, and I've even baked some biscuits. So I've learned something new under lockdown. How do you feel about what is going on in the world? It's very sad. Um, it's a very difficult time for everybody in the world. It's hard, especially for poor people. It's so um, I think our country is reacting well to this lockdown. We are thankful for our president and his leading, but it's a very bad time and something we've never, ever experienced in our almost 70 years of life. Are you reading more books than you did before COVID-19? I'm, I'm reading more books. Um, definitely a time to, to read a lot. So that has been a new experience for me to read all these books. What are you missing from before COVID-19? We miss our grandchildren and we miss walking on the beach. And we miss just doing some exercise. I used to go to the gym almost every day and now I'm not allowed to go. So those are some of the things that we really miss. And we miss going to church. What hobbies have you taken up? Well, cooking has now become a good hobby for me and being able to do and learn various things. So that has been also a, a great experience doing something new. And I've made masks and I've done more crocheting and I've done more knitting. And as I said, I did that jigsaw puzzle. So yeah, we're keeping ourselves busy. What good movies or documentaries have you watched? Well, we watched Wild Earth, which is a, a live safari. Most evenings we see that. We also have seen new movies. There was one that was really, really enjoyed called I Can Only Imagine. And um, we also okay. saw The Lion King. The updated the one. updated one. So that was a good experience as well. Have you had a pajama day? I beg your pardon? Have Say you had again? a pajama day? A pajama day? No, not a pajama day. Do you have a vegetable garden? I have a very tiny vegetable garden because I don't actually have a garden. Most of my plants are in pots or boxes. And I have some spinach, some parsley, some herbs. Do you know anybody who has COVID-19? We don't know anybody personally, but we know of somebody who goes to our church who has COVID-19. But our family and friends are well, thank heavens. How will you celebrate when COVID-19 is over? We'll go see our grandkids. And then go to the beach and buy an ice cream and walk in the water. What has been good about lockdown? Well, lockdown, I think, has been good in that it does show that one can stay at home. You can stay indoors. You can find things to do. But it's not always easy for everybody during lockdown to be able to appreciate what, what we can. So, What uh, I think that that's good about lockdown is it's made us all slow down and appreciates 
things, appreciate our life that we had before, and instead of just rushing around, that we now really appreciate um, our friends, our family, appreciate being able to get out and do things, appreciate the, the world around us. And um, lockdown is teaching us that uh, we need to just be more appreciative of our lives. As we are coming to an end of lockdown, looking back, how would you have prepared differently knowing what you know now? I would have prepared by getting a lot more paints because my painting jobs, I've run out of paint and I've run out of, of um, paint, stripper. paint stripper, things like that, cleaning material for the paints. So little did I know that it was going to be so long, so I would have just done some more preparation or better preparation than I did, not knowing what was going to happen with when this virus hit us. Mm. We were fine for food and everything, so we didn't have to stock up too much. And um, what would I have done? Maybe got more books. Yeah, because I'm getting to the stage where I have to start rereading. Thank you for being my, answering my interview questions.